Michael, the Mercedes guy here, and I've got something a little different, and that is how to protect your home when you're having forest fires or grassland fires. It's so easy for embers to come and land on your roof if it isn't a metal roof or uh, some kind of non-flammable material. Most houses are asphalt roofing or wood, shingle. So, you set up some rainbird sprinklers on your roof. Very easy to do and control. I'm going to turn these off now. You can see my apparatus. This is a manifold. You can get it at your hardware store or your home improvement store. You should have a couple brackets to make it stable. I have yet to do that. This is for one sprinkler. This is for two of the sprinklers. This is my regular garden hose. And then, of course, I got just a f one for water. Now, the way you set this up is to use a regular rainbird sprinkler. And you flip this thing up like this so that it will go around and around and around. And use a block of wood to fasten it to. Your house will be at an angle, so a couple of metal straps. And I don't have one to show you because it's up on the roof, but you put in a reducer here for three-quarter pipe, and then you buy a fitting at your home improvement store. Now, the fittings at your home improvement store, there's two varieties of these babies. The difference is the color. This is gray. This is black. The black one screws on faucet threads. The gray one screws on to pipe thread. And very easy screws on to pipe thread, whereas this is different threads. It won't screw on worth a darn, and it won't seal. So you use a gray one for your pipe thread, and then you can just buy this cheap half-inch drip line tubing, really cheap, and on the end for your faucet manifold, you put a black one, and that screws right on. Now, with this setup, there can be a forest fire or a range fire at my place, or near my place, and the embers coming, I'll be able to save my house. Easy to do, cheap. Now there's companies I've seen on the news, they charge thousands of dollars to do this. You can do it yourself for a couple hundred bucks.